Hey, hello there, how is everyone doing? I'm DCSK and thanks for checking out my video. Alright guys and girls, in this video, I'll be sharing with you guys on how to duplicate as many insane power level glitch gear as you want. Um, but first, uh, I gotta tell every one of you that um, this method only works on PC. I don't think it's gonna work on console. I'll be sharing with you guys why later. Um, for PC players, first you need at least one joystick. It is better to have two. If you just have one, um, you need a software uh, to make the game, uh, I mean uh, to make Minecraft Dungeon to be able to play two player locally with uh, mouse and keyboard plus joystick. So the joystick will be acting as a player 2 and keyboard and mouse will be player 1. You need a software to make it work. I already uh, show you guys uh, how to do that uh, in another video and I'm not gonna re uh, repeat it again in this video so I'll be sharing with you, uh, uh, I mean uh, I'll put the link uh, right down there. Alright, um, make sure to check that out. And um, alright, um, let's get back to this uh, video. Okay, the first step you need to do is, uh, this is uh, my original save game data. So uh, the first thing you need to do is uh, run the tower, any tower, tower 3, tower 4, tower 5. Um, uh, finish the tower, uh, beat the final boss, and then uh, do the glitch, like uh, crashing the game. Uh, depending on uh, how many times you want to crash, uh, I think uh, 20 or 21 times is the best number so I already did that so everything is uh, uh, here uh, in this uh, save data so uh, right now I'm gonna show you guys I already did that uh, if you guys don't still don't know about the insane power level glitch uh, I'll put the link at right down there okay make sure to check that out now let's go right there it is I have crashed like uh, I think 20 times um and 216 uh, this is uh, quite a very good number a very perfect number I think a uh, 316 or 319 is the best number you don't need to go uh, further than this number like a 400 500 you need that high number because uh, the damage and the HP uh, will uh, stop here so this is the max uh, for now okay um so this is the best number you don't need to crash uh, more than 20 times Okay, so uh, don't claim anything. I'm just here to show you guys that I already uh, crashed the game for like 20 times. So I'll just close it. Press the M, uh, the map button, and uh, in case you accidentally close it, uh, doesn't matter. Okay, uh, right now I just want to show you guys that. Uh, let's see how many times. Oh, I already crashed the game for like 21 times. That means uh, I or oh no, not crashed the game 21 times. 21 minus uh, 3 is uh, 18. Oh, so I have crashed the game 18 times. So uh, also means that I defeated the boss for 21 times. Alright, I just want to show you guys that I already crashed the game. Now, I'll just return to main menu. Alright, um, step 2. Oh, um, I should have just uh, exit the game. Step 2, you need to exit the game. Uh, step 2, go to your Minecraft dungeon save game folder. You need to find your save data. So uh, the save game folder is located at c user uh your profile name don't look for dcsk you're not gonna find dcsk in your pc um, this will be your profile name whatever you name it go into that folder then save game folder mojang folder uh yeah, mojang studio folder dungeon folder and a lot of number are uh, random number folder go into that folder and then character folder then in this character folder you will find your save data so i only have one hero so i only have one data in the uh, inside the character folder if you have multiple hero you will find a uh, multiple data uh, in that case you need to find the data that you just uh, crashed the game for like uh, 20 times just an example i don't know how many times you're gonna crash okay so you need to find the data and then you're gonna make a backup copy it copy and then uh, you can back up any way you like, uh, maybe desktop or upper level. I will just uh, back up the data at upper level. So I'll just paste it at here. Okay, um, and then you will be replacing this uh, data that contain the tower progress that you just uh, uh, crashed like uh, 20 times. Again, again, and again, and again inside this folder after you claim the gear reward from the tower uh, you might not uh, really understand what i'm trying to, to tell you uh, don't worry i'll be showing you guys uh, in a while um, this is the first why doesn't work on console player 
console player uh, i don't think you guys are able to copy the data inside your console and then make a backup of it and then uh, you'll be able to copy the backup data and then uh, replace to the original one again again and again and again i don't think you'll be able to do that all right i already make a that uh, a backup so i will just uh launch i uh, relaunch the game right now and i will continue step three all right step three now go to hero setting okay see that only have one uh save data now select the uh the only data i mean uh, your data that have cr already crashed the tower like uh, 20 times select this data and then change the skin this is just to mark uh uh the save data uh, i mean uh, into a different one okay change your skin that you don't usually use one okay uh let's say example this is my uh, original save data skin so i'll be all, uh, all the time i'll be using this one so you you will need to change it to another one uh, i'll just uh, select this oh yeah this boy handsome boy so i'll be selecting this one and then upload this hero okay select empty slot upload it all right i'll make a backup of it now uh, change back the skin to the original one now done next select the empty slot download the hero that you just uploaded to the cloud download this one then i just uh, then i just upload that one okay there it is yeah read the duplicated uh, uh i mean i just uh, duplicate my save data so this one will be my uh, uh this one uh this save data will be acting as player two and uh here's the second why it doesn't work on console the data the original data that you just uh that i just uploaded or you just uploaded to the cloud save it doesn't save it doesn't upload the the tower progress together so that means if i start uh the game with this character the reward claiming screen is not going to pop up because the cloud save doesn't save the tower progress so i'm gonna show you guys right now so remember this is player two character player one character is at right behind so i'll be selecting this character i'll just show you guys that it doesn't pop up the uh, reward claiming screen now let's go see that the reward uh, claiming screen is not popping out i gotta rerun the tower again so nope nope okay so this is why it doesn't work on console i'm sorry guys i'm sad for you guys uh if you make it work make sure to share with me at comment below okay all right i'll just uh, return to main menu now go to hero setting this is player 2 player 2 will be using uh, joystick and this is player 1 so mouse and keyboard will be selecting as player 1 right now player 2 it's time to join the game uh, by using joystick Ta -da. okay player 2 will be selecting this uh, save data Ta -da. there it is i'm able to play minecraft dungeon locally with uh, joystick and uh, keyboard and mouse Okay, um, I will just uh, name this one uh, the original save data as uh, original save data and this uh, uh, save data I will name it as a uh, Merry Christmas save data since the Christmas uh, the Christmas is coming very soon all right so now let the journey begin I mean the duplication <laughs> let the journey begin I'll be showing you guys on how to duplicate uh, as many instant power level glitch gear as you want all right um don't uh claim any reward right now if you claim it right now player two is gonna claim nothing okay so just uh close it by pressing m if you accidentally close it whoopsie don't worry just bring up the map go to tower and then continue the game i mean the tower all right here i am hey um 
as you all know that I show you guys that the player 2 doesn't uh, have any tower progress and uh, don't worry whenever player 1 start the tower uh, that contain uh, the safe data that contain uh, the tower progress uh, together with the 10 to 8, uh, the 21 time crash or whatever number you uh, you did uh, player 2 uh, if you have a uh, player 3 or player 4 every one of them will be able to claim or the grief uh, will be able to claim all the gift from the tower uh, reward claiming screen yeah that player 2 is using a crappy that crappy gear everything is crappy so it's totally zero tower progress so don't worry you are going to claim a free gift I mean a, a free gear all right so I will just uh, exit it right now Ta -da, player 2 got a free win Alright, wow, I got a... Uh, let's see, uh, okay, uh, right now, claim the best reward you want. Okay, um, I'm just gonna show you guys an example. Wow, man, this bubble buster. Wow, uh, um, this bow, yeah, yeah, uh, it's with a perfect enchantment. Woo, yeah, I'm getting this one. So, player one is getting this one. So, I just uh, claim this one. Um, let's see, uh, player two, um, don't select the same, uh, gear. Select a different one. Uh, maybe, uh, who are they? Wow, man, this B is very very good um it comes with a perfect enchantment so i'm gonna get this one now just claim it okay open the box i know what i got Ta -da! see that player one is getting the reward from the tower as well as player two okay continue to the game now let's check out player two inventory Ta -da! wow player two also got a 19 uh power uh, insane power level gears right um just close it okay player one let's check out the inventory oh player one also got 219 power level gears all right uh, right now um just uh you can just uh, transfer your player one gears let's say oh this power bar uh, this bubble booster is uh is with a uh, comes with a perfect enchantment uh you may want to transfer it to the uh, to player two too because uh, cause, uh you'll be replacing the original save data again again and again and again and again until you think it is enough all right so just transfer it to player 2 i mean i give it to player 2 all right so no more bubble buster in player 1 inventory well, let's check out player 2 oh there it is there is the bubble buster that i just got uh uh from a uh, player one hey um the uh, it is going to reset the power uh, item power level uh, based on your total power level so definitely you're not go going to get the same uh uh in uh that uh insane power uh insane item power level gears uh uh reward from the tower you're not gonna get a 319 so we, uh, the, the level will reset based on your uh, total item power uh, i mean a uh, total power level so don't worry just get it since it is free um if you think that uh, you don't need it anymore i mean uh, all the gifted gears you don't want uh, don't worry just uh, give it to player two and then you can salvage it for go uh, for right now i'm not gonna salvage it so i'll just uh, leave it so i'll just uh, close it now uh let's do it again so i'll just uh Quick the game and then ah uh, there you go here you can see that um this is my main data file uh, and uh, this is the player two who are uh, married which much uh save data so if you're mul uh if you're multiple character you're you're going to see even more now right now go back to the uh go back to upper level folder copy the backup data uh wherever you back up it maybe at desktop so we just copy it and then go back to the character folder paste it again replace the file Magic. everything is back all the tower progress are uh, 21 time crash game is back to player one safe data all right um player one data everything is back now player two let's join the game please must save file now let the uh, let the game begin Ta -da! see that the reward claiming screen is popping up again um remember don't claim 
after reward right now close it by pressing M uh, and then uh, go back to the tower oh wait before I go back let me show you a okay, player one has uh, nothing in inventory because uh, I just replaced the file and everything back to original and as for player two okay, I'll just open up the inventory see that the item is still here the insane power level gears and the gifted item from player one just now all right now just close it i'm gonna get even more gears now player one let's start the tower continue let's go okay immediately all right um again get the two best gear that you want let's say oh i want this a uh, black spot armor wow mm, perfect enchantment wow I, I must get this one uh, player one get this one and player two remember get a different one uh, maybe oh i like uh, this uh, fox armor wow nice one yeah i'm getting this one all right all right i know what i'm getting but uh okay now back to the camp okay do the same uh the original save data give this item to player 2 now let's check out player 2 inventory Ta-da! i got two uh insane power level gears <laughs> yeah <laughs> easy right so that you don't need to complete the tower and crash the game again and again and again and again you just need to do it once um, but set to inform that again uh, this method only works on uh, pc uh if console player if you find a way to make this work make sure to share with me a comment below thank you very much all right and again if you don't like these uh, gifted gears maybe you just want to earn some go yeah you can just uh salvage it or go all right and um uh glitching the game will actually uh destroy the fun so uh, always uh, make sure before you glitch the game you can either duplicate a, a, a another save file that one is is a merry glitchmas uh save data so you can always uh, have fun uh, with all the glitch with the glitchmas uh, save data so that it doesn't affect your original one like uh, my player one or uh, this is a uh, original uh, save game data so i play it uh, digitally you know something like that uh yeah some people don't like to play the game with the glitch yeah glitch definitely destroy the fun and i do this is just uh, for uh, experimental purpose all right so i hope you guys are uh, enjoy it too mm, if you guys are uh, enjoy uh my video um don't forget to smash a like and subscribe to my channel okay and uh, if you guys have any question or suggestion you can always uh leave a comment below or email in my discord community everyone is welcome to join and if you guys uh, don't really understand what i am trying to uh, uh, share with you guys uh, you can always uh, ask again and comment below all right guys and girls hope you all uh, enjoyed this video and again don't forget to smash a like and subscribe to my channel okay thank you very much for the support and last time thanks for watching um happy glitching the game and i hope you guys are uh, have fun with the glitch uh have fun with the glitch uh, while it lasts so uh have a nice day uh i'm gonna see you in the next video stay healthy stay safe see ya Ta -ta. Oh.